could this officially be the end of Uber? We're gonna find out today. We have massive, massive update. You don't wanna miss this video. It could be time to start looking for other sources of income. Please, thumbs up the video, my friends. I wanna hear from you guys. Are you still driving for Uber? Are you still driving for these gig apps? What are your current thoughts with the pay structure that Uber has? And I did wanna say there is an app that is helping drivers make more money and it's called Solo, which is our video sponsor for today. That's the business app for gig workers. They're providing guaranteed pay. This is a revolutionary uh, new business model that is allowing gig workers to earn more income. As you can see here, if you go to sign on 10, 10 a.m., they're gonna guarantee that you make 37 bucks in that hour, Harry Campbell from the Rideshare Guy, as you can see, is an investor and an advisor, just super awesome for solo technologies. They just got five million bucks in funding. They have this article on GeekWire, and we have a sponsorship with them below. When you sign up, you can get access to all of this. Uh, you can earn $5,000 more a year. It's really awesome. These are all the versions they have available. Uh, free version, $399 version, $799 version. All of those, when you sign up, you're gonna get 15 bucks and uh, just you gotta link your account and let's get started. So hundreds of female passengers have just sued Uber and you could potentially join this. More than 500 female passengers have filed a lawsuit against US-based rideshare transportation service Uber, alleging that they were SA'd by contract drivers in a complaint filed by San Francisco-based law firm Slater Slater Shulman LLP on Thursday. The woman alleged that they were kidnapped, falsely imprisoned, stalked, harassed and R-worded, among other incidents by drivers on the transportation platform. The lawsuit also claims that Uber found in 2009 was aware of the severity of reported incidents of misconduct of some of the drivers on their platform since 2014. Does, should Uber shut down their app? Guys, this is serious. You've seen the allegations that were proposed. This could potentially cause Uber to go bankruptcy. If they're aware of these things are going on, and they're not doing anything to prevent it, you know what they should be doing? They should, by minimum, putting a dash cam in every single Uber car. When a driver signs up to drive for Uber, they should provide a dash cam. They can get these dash cams for cheap in China. They manufacture these dash cams for so cheap, they can buy them in bulk and provide them to drivers. So that way, every single ride is accounted for. There's no you know, misconduct. There's no room for these things to happen. But Uber just goes, oh no, it's not our problem. We're just a technology platform. The drivers and the, the riders, you know, we're just providing the service for them to meet. This is not our problem. You know what? Yes, it is, Uber. You, are, you created this app. You created this experience. And it is your job to make sure that every single ride is safe. Every single driver, every single passenger feels safe. And if it's not, then that's, that's on you, Uber. That is completely 100% on you. And you should take the blame for this. So I'm gonna keep you guys updated with what happens here, but this is very, very serious, nothing to take lightly. And Uber CEO should feel ashamed of himself for allowing this to happen on his network. So anyways, wanted to make this video and comment down below. Have you had any negative experiences at all? Um, and also, please, uh, before you do, uh, before you end the video, check out Solo in the link in the description box. Like I said below, they are providing guaranteed pay features, which is super awesome. And a lot of people who are complaining about, you know, how they don't make enough money driving for any of the gig apps, you can sign up for Solo right now and start earning extra income, right? They are providing drivers with pay guarantee, which is kudos to this company for actually caring for gig workers and allowing gig workers to earn extra income. You go out and you drive for DoorDash. They're gonna guarantee that you make 38 bucks an hour. You go out and drive for Uber for one hour. They're gonna guarantee that you make that. Instacart, 37 bucks in that hour. So sign up for Solo. It's, they have free versions uh, to sign up. You can get started. They have free trials as well. And there's no you know uh, minimums. Like it's monthly. You can cancel at any time. And they do have discounts if you do um, go for uh, annual as well. So thanks for watching, guys. You guys are great. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye now.